States, and Jay-Z is really good, and every time Jay-Z does a song, everybody loves it. So what's wrong with doing something that sounds like Jay-Z in Australia, but it's expressing Australian way of life? Because every time you send a record, uh, a demo to a record company, and it's Australian, it sounds like something from the States, nobody's even gonna look at it, they'll just put it away. That's my point of view, I just wanted to find out what's wrong with that. I think Paul Patico should answer that. I was going to say, come on, bro. <laughs> uh, well, I don't think we have a Jay-Z. I don't think we uh, have a Jay-Z, per se, but I think uh, bands that are talking about... Are you specific, speaking specifically about hip-hop acts? Well, we do. We have a huge uh, Australian hip-hop culture, um, and I think they're selling records. I think they're also fiercely independent. Um, a lot of them have shunned the traditional label systems and created their own labels and made, um, uh, motivated their own fans and around their own culture. So um, I would say to you that there is a market for the pop in this country. I would say to you that if you're not getting the love from us, do it yourself. Uh, it's proven there's a model there, it works. The Hoods are one of the biggest bands in the country. I think that they're, they're making it happen. Uh, you know, I don't know, you're asking me a question, how do you make somebody like your music? I don't, can't answer that question. Yeah, and, and, and often, you know, not being in a record company, but often people will, if we pass on something for airplay, people will come up with all sorts of reasons why we haven't played it, and it's essentially because we don't think it's as good as some of the other stuff we're getting. But they'll go into, oh, because it's a, an American sound. I mean, if there's an Australian artist here doing hip-hop that's got an American sound to it, it's a different. Yeah, I mean, yeah, Dear Freaks or Dear Freaks, we're, you know, we're, we're playing their latest record. It's just got to be good enough. It's, it's, it's not about style or whether it sounds American or anything like that. Um, so, yeah, that's my perspective on it anyway. Okay, and we've unfortunately run out of time because the next panel is running a bit late. So, uh, if you